Sup, y'all? Bring you guys another video. One Hang Menayodin versus Panya Pradabstri. Who do you guys think is gonna win this fight? Before we get into the video, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video and it helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So, anyway, like I was saying, who do y'all think is gonna win between One Hang Menayodin? And Panya. Um, yeah, this fight's happening this Friday on the 27th of November, November 27, 2020, over in Thailand. Wan Hang Menayodin, aka Chaya Phon Monsri, will be defending his WBC minimum weight title for the how many times now? He's defended it multiple times. I don't even know. I lost count. But he's defended it a lot of times throughout uh, since 20. When did he win it? 2014. He won it in 2014 and he's defended it successfully ever since then. And uh, now here he is fighting uh, a fellow Thai in uh, Panya. Uh, he's also known as, um, yeah, I said one hang Minayotin Kayang Dagada. That's how he's, I don't know how to say his name. But he's obviously known for his record 54 0, 18 wins, coming by way of Nakar Tikio. Undefeated after 54 fights, uh, passing Floyd Mayweather's record of 50 0. And here he is still fighting. At the age of 35, defending his title against uh, Panya Prabdrasi, aka Petch Petch Money CP Fresh Mart Cook It Gym. Um, <laughs> yeah, P CP Fresh Mart Cook It Gym is a very uh, that's a very known known uh, gym over there, right? I mean, they always have this name CP Fresh Mart. But but yeah, like I said earlier, he's from Thailand too. He has a decent record of 34 wins. One loss, 22 wins come by way of Nakar Tikiao. He won the Asian WBC minimum weight title in his last fight against uh, Seng Prak Puan back in September of this year. Um, yeah, and he also won the OPBF silver light flyweight title. Holy shit, is this guy... Did he really lose that much? Oh no, light flyweight, light flyweight. Um, but yeah, if you look at his resume, not really the best resume out there. I mean... Look at the look at the records of the guys he's fought. Like this year alone, he fought two guys who just had their pro debuts. <laughs> so I mean, that tells you the love of competition he's fighting. I mean, the same thing could be said for uh, one hangman Ayodin early on in his career. But at the same time, he's fought some top competition throughout his career. Some top competition. At least guys with decent records, and uh, he's proven that he is. A legitimate fighter at the minimum weight division, 105 pounds. As for Panya, not so much. And I watched some footage of Panya. I watched some footage of him. By the way, he's ranked number three under the WBC. Um, One Hang is the champion at 105, and Panya is ranked number three. And I, I watched some footage of him, and you know, it's okay. He he likes to come forward. He likes to make it a fight. He likes uh, to uh, stay there and exchange in the middle of the ring. Uh, when it comes down to it, when it comes to who will win this fight, it just comes down who is tougher, stronger, more um, faster, and obviously who's more experienced. And that fighter is Wan Hang Minayodin. He edges Panya in every single category, in my opinion, even at the age of 35. But that's the question. At 35, did he age fast? Like I said, the last time he was in the ring was October of 2019. So within this past year, did he age? Did he just get old just like that? That is the question. And we'll find out this Friday. If he does, if he looks old and slow, this is not going to be an easy fight for Juan Hangman Ayodin. But if he's still the same fighter from last year, when he fought uh, Takuhara and when he fought Konko, if he's still the same fighter from last year, he should be able to go out there and, uh, and outwork, outscore. Panya Prabdrasi. And I apologize if I'm mispronouncing her names, by the way. So, so yeah, looking forward to it. Um, One Hang should be able to come out victorious and remaining undefeated, but you never know when it comes to the sport, right? Anything is possible in the sport of boxing. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts. Thank you so much for listening and watching. Do not forget to hit that like button if you haven't yet, please. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet, please. And like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.